Welcome to our video on 25 facts about our solar system. Let's explore the wonders of space. Our cosmic neighborhood is filled with fascinating celestial bodies. Ready to learn more? Number 1, NASA's Voyager 1 spacecraft was launched in 1977. More than three decades later, in 2012, it became the first human-made object to enter interstellar space by crossing the heliopause, or the edge of the heliosphere. That's the boundary beyond which most of the sun's ejected particles and magnetic fields dissipate. Number 2 Uranus usually appears in classroom solar system models as a featureless blue ball, but this gas giant of the outer solar system is pretty weird on closer inspection. First, the planet rotates on its side, appearing to roll around the sun like a ball, according to NASA's Uranus Guide. The most likely explanation for the planet's unusual orientation, about 90 degrees sideways compared to the other planets, is that it underwent some sort of titanic collision in the ancient past. Number 3, compared to Earth's peaceful moon, Jupiter's moon Io may come as a surprise. The Jovian moon has hundreds of volcanoes and is considered the most active moon in the solar system, sending plumes of sulfur up to 190 miles, 300 kilometers, into its atmosphere. According to a statement from NASA, Io's volcanoes emit one ton, more than 900 kilograms, of gases and particles into the space near Jupiter each second. Number 4, while Mars seems quiet now, gigantic volcanoes once dominated the surface of the planet. This includes Olympus Mons, the biggest volcano ever discovered in the solar system. At 374 miles 602 kilometers across, the volcano is comparable to the size of Arizona. It's 16 miles 25 kilometers high, or triple the height of Mount Everest, the tallest mountain on Earth. By volume, according to NASA, Olympus Mons is 100 times larger than Earth's largest volcano, Hawaii's Mauna Loa. Number 5, at 2,500 miles 4, kilometers, long, the immense system of Martian canyons known as Valles Marineris is more than 10 times as long as the Grand Canyon on Earth. Valles Marineris escaped the notice of early Mars spacecraft, which flew over other parts of the planet, and was finally spotted by the global mapping mission Mariner 9 in 1971. And what a sight it was to miss, Valles Marineris could stretch from coast to coast of the entire United States. Number 6 Venus is a hellish planet with a high temperature, high pressure environment on its surface. Bone dry and hot enough to melt lead, it's not exactly a welcoming environment, and has probably always been inhospitable to life. When heavily shielded Venera spacecraft from the Soviet Union landed there in the 1970s, according to NASA each lasted a few minutes or, at most, a few hours before melting or being crushed beyond their ability to function. Number 7 Water can be found as ice in permanently shadowed craters on Mercury and the Moon, although we don't know if there's enough to support prospective human colonies in those places. Mars also has ice at its poles, in frost and likely below the surface dust. Even smaller bodies in the solar system have ice, Saturn's moon Enceladus, and the dwarf planet Ceres, among others. Number 8, we've been exploring space for more than 60 years, and have been lucky enough to get close-up pictures of dozens of celestial objects. Most notably, we've sent spacecraft to all of the planets in our solar system, Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune, as well as two dwarf planets, Pluto and Ceres. Number 9, so far, scientists have found no evidence that life exists elsewhere in the solar system. But as we learn more about how extreme microbes live in underwater volcanic vents or frozen environments, more possibilities open up for where they could live on other planets. Number 10 Pluto is a tiny world at the edge of the solar system, so scientists assumed the dwarf planet would have a fairly uniform, crater-pocked environment. That changed when NASA's New Horizons spacecraft flew by in 2015, sending back pictures that altered our view of Pluto forever. Number 11 Pluto's observed atmosphere broke all the predictions. Scientists saw the unexpected haze extending as high as 1,000 miles, 1,600 kilometers, rising higher above the surface than the atmosphere on Earth. As data from NASA's New Horizons mission flowed in, 
Scientists analyzed the haze and discovered some surprises there, too. Number 12. We've known about Saturn's rings since telescopes were invented in the 1600s, but it took spacecraft and more powerful telescopes built in the last 50 years to reveal more. We now know that every planet in the outer solar system, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune, has a ring system. But the rings differ from planet to planet, Saturn's spectacular halo, made in part of sparkly, reflective water ice, is not repeated anywhere else. Instead, the rings of the other giants are likely made of rocky particles and dust. Number 13 Neptune is roughly 30 times as far from the Sun as Earth, and it gets correspondingly less heat and light. But it radiates far more heat than it's taking in and has far more activity in its atmosphere than planetary scientists would suspect, especially compared to nearby Uranus. Uranus is closer to the Sun and yet radiates about the same amount of heat as Neptune, and scientists aren't sure why. Number 14 Comets used to be the province of amateur astronomers, who spent night after night scouring the skies with telescopes. While some professional observatories also made discoveries while viewing comets, that began to change with the launch of the Solar and Heliospheric Observatory, SOHO, in 1995. Since then, the spacecraft has found more than 2,400 comets, which is a pretty productive side mission for a telescope meant to observe just the Sun. These comets are nicknamed sungrazers. Number 15 Along with being the solar system's largest planet, Jupiter also hosts the solar system's largest storm. Known as the Great Red Spot, it's been observed in telescopes since the 1600s and studied from modern instruments like NASA's Juno, which recently provided evidence that the storm is hundreds of miles tall, and likely fed by winds from thousands of miles below, too. The storm has been a raging conundrum for centuries, but in recent decades another mystery emerged, the spot is getting smaller. That concludes our video on 15 facts about our solar system. We hope you enjoyed the journey through space. Stay curious, keep exploring, and remember, the universe is full of wonders waiting to be discovered. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, share and subscribe.